Like many video platforms, you can record yourself, your screen, or both together like I'm doing now. But the real magic comes from our dynamic video feature, which is where you're able to take one video and personalize it at scale with AI. What you'll do is click create dynamic video, give your campaign a name, and then record the video using the placeholder word watermelon instead of recording with your viewer's actual first name. And we support a few other languages here. So if you don't speak English, just click your language and you'll see the instructions change for you. Um, then you can just record your video or click this option to just get in there without recording. In our dynamic video builder, you'll be able to preview the AI of your voice, make sure we're getting a good voice clone for you. Hi, Bethany. Sounds pretty good. And you can also use a dynamic background feature to make it look like you're recording over any website or LinkedIn profile. If you're doing this, just set a fallback so that if you don't have someone's website or you're missing some data, then they'll still get a great video. You can customize the video landing page. So when you send out your video, you know, you're not just sending out a video, you're sending out a nice customized video page that has some other text around the video. You can use more personalized variables here. You can add buttons, multiple buttons, and you can embed your calendar so that people can seamlessly book meetings right after watching. And we have a bunch of calendar integrations here. And then in the last step, you'll just add your contacts. So I'll make a quick video for me and Steve. Um, and you can either type in the names like I'm doing now, or you can import a CSV, or if you are super advanced, you can set up an automation to automatically create videos from Clay, HubSpot, Zapier, any automation tool, so that whenever a trigger happens, you can automatically create a video and then automatically send it out, which is really cool. Um, but if you're just making quick videos, you'll hit generate, you'll get a preview of your um, dynamic video credits, and then a preview of how much time's remaining and then you'll just see the videos start to process here. When they're done, you can always send them out one-on-one -on -one if you're gonna send it in a quick email or LinkedIn message. But if you wanna send them at scale, you'll click share campaign. And here we have a bunch of email um, integrations. So basically what you're doing is you're grabbing that one dynamic video snippet for the platform that you're gonna send in. And then the same way you can use first name, company name, other variables and email, you'll have your dynamic video snippet and that's gonna change for every person. So for example, if we wanna take um, a video and send an outreach, we can just click on outreach here, grab this snippet, go to our outreach sequence, paste in the video snippet, and you'll see on the left, I have my generic video, but on the right, we have that one personalized for Steve. Um, so this is how it works. I'll also play these videos so you can hear the AI. Hi, Steve. I just generated this video using SenseBark's AI. And here's another one. Hi, Bethany. I just generated this video using SenseBark. So you can see the AI is pretty realistic. Um, you'll also be able to view analytics here. Uh, there's no data for this one yet, but if you check out the sample data, you'll see you'll, you'll be able to see like who's watching your video, what percentage they watched. You can sync all this with your CRM for better tracking. And you really have everything you need here to scale your video outreach. Definitely let us know if you have any questions, if there's anything we can help you with, but otherwise enjoy and happy recording.